praise the Lord. Praise the living Jesus. Praise the lily of the valley. Amen. This afternoon, I'm a messenger carrying the good news to the Church of Christ. But therefore, all the congregants, viewers all over the world, pay attention to the words uttered by his able servant, Prophet Philip Banda, to the church. Amen. 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 The prophet says, Master the art of new beginnings. Master the art of new beginnings. Create a life of new beginnings. Life's changes might unsettle you, but don't waste your energy trying to repel them. Life's changes might unsettle you, but don't waste your energy trying to repel them. The prophet says, embrace them and learn from them. These life changes that might unsettle you, please don't waste your energy trying to repel them. Embrace them and learn from them. Amen. Amen. The prophet says, you and I should grow from our challenges. All challenges are a benefit to you and I. All challenges are a benefit to you and I. Amen. Now, you and I ought not to cling to our familiar situations. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, cling not to your familiar situation. Amen. This familiar situation no longer works to your benefit, emotionally and spiritually. This familiar situation that you are clinging to no longer works to your benefit, emotionally and spiritually. The prophet says, growth is a do-or-die mission. Tell your neighbor, neighbor, growth is a do or die mission. Growth is a do or die mission. Amen. The prophet says stagnation is not a viable option. It is not worthwhile at all. Stagnation is not a viable option. It is not worthwhile at all. Master the art of stepping forward. Amen. Amen. Master the art of stepping forward. Master the art of stepping forward, armed with faith and courage into uncharted territory. Master the art of stepping forward, armed with faith and courage, into uncharted territory. That means new, unexplored, unfamiliar territory. That means new, unexplored, unfamiliar territory. Hear these words. The prophet says this week, it is never too late to change your destiny. This week, it is never too late to change your destiny. If you mean to do something about those words, it will be a great amen that will shake the heavens and the earth. It is never too late to change your destiny. It is never too late to change your destiny. It is never too late to change your destiny. Amen. Amen. Let us pray.
Father, we thank you. These words are meant for us who are in need of encouragement. Help us to master the art of stepping forward, armed with faith and courage, into uncharted territory. Help us to master this art in the mighty name of Jesus and in the blood of Jesus. Help us to become conquerors and help us to be willing and to be ready to change our destiny. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. 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 Therefore, to all our congregants today, all of you is all over the world, these are the words that the man of God, Prophet Philip Banda, has sent me to say to the Church of Christ. Therefore, embrace these words and let them change your cause for this week. In Jesus' mighty name, amen.